Nation, welcome back to another video. These are my funnest videos every year. Today, we'll be picking my 2022 All-Star Ballot. We'll be starting off with first base for the American League. League. I feel like this is not an argue question. It's either Ty F France or the Toronto Blue Jays All-Star first baseman, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., Personally, I think Vladimir Guerrero Jr., if you look closely, has the better stance, while Ty France has the better average. Vladdy is hitting a 271, 18 home runs, 46 RBIs, and uh, 869 OPS. So we are going to choose um, Vladimir Guerrero Jr., but I can understand if Ty France does win it over him. For first base in the National League, it's either Pete Alonso. Or Paul Goldsmith. Personally, I'm picking Goldie. These numbers look absolutely incredible. With a three, almost a 350 average, with 19 home runs, 65 RBIs, and a 100. I mean, 1,068 OPS at the All Star break. Today is June 29th. That's pretty incredible. So I'm picking um, Paul Goldsmith for second base. This can go either way between Jose Altuve and Santiago Espinal. I feel like Andres Jimenez should get some acknowledgement too, but I feel like Jose Altuve deserves it this year. And for the National League, Jazz Chisholm stats look pretty good with a, two, a 245 average, 14 home runs, 45 RBIs, and an 860 OPS. For third base, this is a toss-up in the American lead between Jose Ramirez and Rafael Devers. Personally, I'm picking Jose Ramirez. This is a coin toss, too. Either way, both third, um, Rafael Devers and Jose Ramirez have had MVP-type seasons. Over at first base, base, it's Manny Machado. This is not this is not a debate. In the absence of Tatis Jr., Manny Machado has really stepped up with a 328 average, 12 home runs, 46 RBIs. At shortstop, Bo Bichette has been good, but I feel like you have to choose Tim Anderson. Even though he did get injured, these stats looked really great. great. And then in the National League, um, I do think it has to be Trey Turner. His speed, his on-base percentage is off the charts. Blue Jays, Alejandro Kirk. Captain Kirk has been phenomenal this year. A, a staple in the Blue Jays lineup with a 325 average, highest on the team, 10 home runs, 31 R RBIs, and 940 OPS. And Wilson Contreras for the National League, a 272 average. In the outfield, it's pretty easy in the American League. It is going to be Mike Trout. John, and Mike Trout should be there. Um, George Springer, I think there's um there's um earned some acknowledgement too. You can either go with Taylor Ward, but I do think that um where is he? Where is he? So George Springer, Michael Trout, Aaron Judge, 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 Judge. Aaron Judge, MVP type season. He has 30 home runs and it's the All-Star break. Incredible. And for and for the National League, Acuna, Acuna, Mookie Betts, and I feel like it should be Jock Peterson. His numbers look great. And then for the DH in the American League, it's either Shohei Otani or Jordan Alvarez. I think Jordan has been absolutely incredible this season. And even though Bryce Harper did get injured, he uh, deserves some acknowledgement too. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys drop a like as always. I'll be going to the TFC game tonight, so you'll be getting a vlog of that um, by the end of this week. EVR Sports, out.